I knew you were gonna throw that out. That's fire safety. <sighs> Good morning, everybody. I'm gonna go ahead and film this before uh, stuff actually starts to happen because I'm about to head back to the house to get the excavator. Just dropped off the 12 with V-belt. He's gonna do some mulching while I'm gone. And the story behind this is, uh, I think it's an old horse pasture. Yeah, that's what it is, horse pasture, because there's a barn over there. It's been a while since we looked at this job, so I'm gonna jog my memory. But you can see all this, all these bushes here. These are the, you gotta be careful with these dang things. You get some thorns and stuff in you, no good. This is gonna be some good work for the 12. I'm gonna bring the uh, lamb track back at his nether point, but we gotta open this whole area up, all of this. I think we're gonna leave a couple of these bushes, but for the most part, we're gonna reclaim this whole pasture. I mean, look at this, this stuff's 12, 15 feet tall. Right here on the edge, it's tan. But this is what we need to bring back the alley for, the DCR head, is that big sucker right there. Uh, I think I'll count it real quick how many forks are out the top of this. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. Eleven, maybe twelve. Eleven or twelve tops on that sucker. So we're gonna grind that whole sucker up because ah, that ponderosa pine is just crap. But I'm gonna head back to the house. I gotta take the CMAF off of the 80. Uh, I might show you guys some of that. But this is today's job. So again, good morning everybody. Hope you're having a good day. Let's get to work. Well, we're back at the job with the excavator now. Forgot one thing uh, that we're doing is taking this big old hedge bush out. I'll show you a picture of what it started off as. I'm in here. Pulling all this crap out of there. That's what happens when you don't tame your bush. Edge bush was growing so thick that it was on the road.
All systems are a go, everything's still running green. Brought the lamb track this morning. Might get to that big old 11 top tree today. So, brought this old girl. We built did a little modifications to her. Uh, set up for the dual straight hydraulic coolers along with the stock one. So it's got three hydraulic coolers on it. This thing likes to run right about 100, 110. Uh, and then he modified the case drain so it just goes straight out of the case drain straight into the machine rather than going through some fittings in the bulkhead and stuff. Uh, a little bit simpler this way. I'm over here and I'll show you guys what the 12's been up to a little bit more. I had to leave five last night. I think V-Bolt worked, yeah, he worked at least another 30, 40 minutes. They want this over here for a buffer so that uh, they can't see their neighbors and their neighbors can't see them. Don't blame them. But this is some thick, nasty dogwood, greasewood bush. I don't know what it is. But we're going to leave a couple of the trees so it's not complete emptiness. And this stuff is just, holy crap, is it stringy. Now, you know, the Prime Tech, it would probably turn a little bit different than this, but for a skid steer powering through what it's doing, I think that 12 is doing a great freaking job. I'll fire up the uh, drone later on for you guys for some of this stuff, but she's doing good. All right, we're going to take down that big leaner. Can't tell, but it's leaning away from us, and then obviously to the right with all them limbs. So we got the lamb track to a pulley on the other side of the excavator up to the back side of the tree trying to counter this direct lean. And then I got the excavator hooked with the 40,000 pound pull rope pulling it sideways. Called in some backup, have my uncle come up here. Dad's younger brother. Yeah. All right, let me check it, let me check it. Not bad. Okay. It went where it was supposed to. You get it all son.
here's the butt cut of that big tree. Loaded up, gonna take it back to the house. Mulched up the top half of it because we can. This just saves a little bit of time. Might make this into lumber or something. Anyway, hope you guys enjoyed. Later.